One day, Rosa and Wally agreed to meet at the tallest pine tree in the forest at 9 a.m. sharp. What's the purpose of this meeting, you might ask? Well, we're about to find <sighs> out. Well, it looks like I'm the first one here yet again. No surprise, I'm on time. I just can't be late. I thought we were meeting at 9 o'clock. Yes, we were. It's already 9.35. You overslept. Huh? Uh, Rosa, you messed up. <gasps> Don't pin this on me. No, wait. It's just that your watch is an hour behind. Or maybe we just live in two different time zones, Buster. No, you just need to reset your watch for daylight saving time. That's why you're an hour early, Rosa. Oh, whatever. I'm right, and Rosa's wrong. Hmm. Hmm. Wally, do you think that we could borrow your hammer? Sure. You're the best. Don't you want to know what we need a hammer for? If you need a hammer, I'm guessing you need to put nails in something? Uh, Wally, is everything all right? <laughs> right. It's not good to keep things bottled up. What happened? Well, Rosa and I got into an argument. And was it your fault? No, it wasn't my fault at all. Then you should go make up with her. No, she made me mad. She forgot to set her watch and then blamed it all on me. All right, so go and talk to her and make up. Be first. No, 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 not at all. Mm -hmm. Molly needs to be tough. Yeah, <laughs> because I'm right and Rosa was wrong. She yelled at me for absolutely no reason. It's all her fault. He's right. She needs to apologize. Be the first and all that. You know, something like this happened to me. What's taking so long? Maybe you should go first. Who, me? Not a chance. No way. But weren't you the one who got the time wrong? Yeah, maybe I did, but that was just a mistake. Oh, but then he hurt my feelings. He said I messed up. Well, <laughs> I'm sure he didn't mean it like that. So much for fiction, Chico's roof. He's got a leak, a big one. Oh, I have to fix this. Who cares if I'm right, if I feel bad? Here's an idea. You could give her some kind of gift. Uh, Maybe make her something to patch yeah. things up. That's it. Make her a cake. <laughs> but I've never made anyone a cake before. It can't be that hard. All you need to do is find yourself a good cookbook and follow the recipe. In fact, I think Rosa has one you can use. Oh, I bet that's him. <laughs> He's come to apologize. <laughs> Hey guys. We're wondering if, well, if we... We need your cookbook! You want my cookbook? Do you even cook? We never have, but we thought we would. And my roof still has that leak in it. Yeah, we need to fix his roof. And you thought my cookbook would help? I want to pickle carrots afterwards. Here you are. So, um, do you like sweet stuff, Rosa? <laughs> sweet stuff? Of yeah, course! Yeah, gotta go! Thanks for the cookbook! Someone borrowed my cookbook one time. Huh? Me again! You think we could borrow some sugar? I think you mean salt. If you were pickling carrots. Um, my grandma used sugar for flavoring. Fine. Here you are. Thanks, Rosa! 
It seems we also need a mixer. Sure. For the carrots, right? Right. For carrots. <laughs> I guess I did yell at Wally for no reason at all. <sighs> it really wasn't his fault. I was wrong. I'll be first to say it. Uh. Ah. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, Rosa. Here, I made you a castle. You can eat it. Oh. Um. Uh. It's good, right? Yes, it's very good, Wally. Thank you. Sometimes I can be sort of unreasonable. <laughs> Forgive me? <laughs> <laughs> you know you ate the cloth, uh, right? Good. That's <laughs> right. More like I said. Like my grandma used to make. <laughs> Which is funny, since this started with your watch and all. <laughs>